Okay, I've had a document, I'm not going to call it a fine, because as far as I can tell it's illegal, um, or certainly not lawful. Uh, a, a, a PCN through from uh, a parking charge note, uh, sorry, a penalty charge notice from Bath and North East Somerset Council to tell me that I've driven through uh, through a, um, a clean air zone in Bath. So I've driven my little work van, which does 55 to the gallon, uh, through uh, through uh, Bath, uh, but apparently that's the emissions are too high, it's too dirty, or I'm not allowed to do it, um, and they've informed me that I owe them all they they want uh, £120, which is a penalty charge. Um, and they very kindly will reduce it to 60 if I pay this within 14 days. Um, so I've driven through Bath and I didn't, oh, yeah, funnily enough, I was trying to avoid pedestrians and, to, uh, uh, and the vehicle in front. So I was driving and not looking out for some sign hidden in the trees, never saw any signs um, to tell me that I had to pay £9 for the privilege of driving down this road in Bath because my vehicle presumably is too old. Um, it's actually a 13 plate, so <laughs> uh, anyway. Um, so the PCN, uh, I don't intend to pay this um, and I'm looking through the document and I'm thinking, what is this? It, it, there's no signature, no name, uh, not, and, and no signature to correspond with. Um, that it's addressed to the wrong person. They've addressed, they've sent it, so the vehicle reg is, is, is mine, but they've addressed it to uh, someone by the name of my first and middle name. So there's no surname um, and no signature and uh, or, or name to, uh, and um, it's, as far as I can tell, it's not been sent to the correct owner. So I'm looking at this document, I'm thinking this, this is not serious, surely. Um, so, Anyway, so as I read through, what are my options? Um, I can either pay the 120 or the 60, or I can make representations. So turnover, um, there's a list from A to G of uh, of, um, the, of of options. Uh, option A is I was not the owner. Option B, the charge does not apply to the vehicle. Option C, the charge for blown, and so on and so on it goes until you get to option F, which is the council has made a procedural error when dealing with my case or the PCN. So that's what I intend to, to turn over, and so I can turn over onto the set, onto, onto the, the next sheet uh, and make my case. Uh, so I will explain your representation or compelling reasons. So I filled in that box and that's gonna be my, um, my, my default position, not to, pay, not to pay this or certainly to, uh, to, to appeal it. Um, and as follows, I have inserted the addressee is not recognized. They haven't sent it to me. They've, they, I don't recognize the name. Um, that's not anybody that lives here. The PCN has not been sent to the owner of the set of said vehicle. Uh, they may think they've sent it to the registered keeper, uh, but, but not the owner. And there is no name or signature anywhere on the document, which means I cannot ascertain obligation to pay. Um, and then, so I've not, it wants my name and address. I, I'm not going to enter into any kind of contract or accept contract with them. And so by filling in my name, they want my name and block capitals. Uh, I won't be filling in name or address and certainly not postcode. Um, the, and so step four, the declaration. Uh, so I filled in my reasons for, you know, uh, for, uh, the procedure, what I believe to be a procedural error. I'm sure there are more. I've listed three errors that I think are, are errors. Uh, and then you've got the, uh, the, so step four is a declaration. Unless this is signed, certain evidence may not be counted as valid. Well, I haven't given any evidence. I've just pointed out the, the you know, the, the mistakes that they've made. Uh, so I won't be signing it. I won't be putting my name in block capitals and uh, my company position, and I certainly won't be putting the date. So I return the whole form to them, uh, and essentially, uh, it, it, with uh, I'm, I'm demanding that they send me something that is signed uh, and with a with a name of a person, a living, breathing person, not an entity, not a corporation. Um, so I will, and I, I think actually it's late. So they they very kindly let me reduce it to sixty from one hundred and twenty. But as far as I can make out, I've only got two days from the issue date above which was about five, four days ago. So, but anyway, 
I'm going to get it sent off uh, and I will let you know how it goes. Cheers, guys.